Have you ever suffered with anything to do with your eyes? Anything like an eye infection, uh, poor vision, blurry vision, dry gritty eyes, anything at all like that? If you have, then you realize how depressing it can be, how painful it can be, because the eyes are the most sensitive or one of the most sensitive parts of your body. So anything that affects your vision can have a real impact on not only your pain levels, but also on your emotional and mental health. Any interference with the functioning of your eyes can leave you anxious, irritable and depressed. And I'm just going to read you a little bit here from the National Eye Institute in the United States and their estimated annual economic burden of vision loss, eye diseases and vision disorders in the States amounts to $139 billion. And those figures were March 2014. So that really surprised me. I was very shocked by that. So this is obviously a huge problem for many people with a huge economic burden on the countries and of different countries' healthcare systems. Eye disorders include things like glaucoma, diabetic retinopathy, and cataracts as well, which is very common. However, we don't have to have a serious eye disease like this for it to seriously impact upon our health. Even conditions such as short or long sightedness, dry eyes, excessive tearing in the eyes or gritty eyes can leave us feeling really miserable. So today what I'm going to be talking to you about and showing you are some Qigong tips that you can use to improve your eye health. My name is Janice Tucker and I'm a practitioner of traditional Chinese medicine and medical Qigong. I'm also the founder of the Space to Relax online program of video lessons. And just before we get started, if I can ask you, if you're watching this video on YouTube, then hit the red subscribe button and so you can sign up for any future health enhancing videos that I publish. And usually I will publish them every one to two weeks. So what can we do to improve the general health of our eyes? I have some Qigong eye exercises for you now, which are really easy to learn. I'll show you how to do them. And the eyes in Chinese medicine are the sense organ that's associated with the liver system. So each organ in Chinese medicine has an associated sense organ. So the liver and the eyes are the ones which go together. So basically with Qigong and with acupuncture and Chinese medicine, anything, any treatment or any exercise which benefits the liver will also benefit the eyes. So the first exercise I'm gonna show you um, just listen to me maybe as we do this because I'm going to ask you to close your eyes first. So all you do is you close your eyes and then what you're going to do is move your eyeballs in different directions. So firstly what you're going to do is move them up and down. So up, looking up towards the ceiling but with your eyes closed and then down as far as you can and then move them both side to side, left and right a few times and then you're going to circle your eyeballs within the eye sockets a few times in one direction and a few times in the other. And then what you can do, follow along with me, open your eyes now, look straight ahead and then again moving the eyes vertically up and down, up and down, up and down and then side to side, one side the other, the other, the other. You see, I'm not turning my head. I'm just moving the eyes in the sockets and then circling in all directions. So that's a little bit harder. So just go slowly with this. But this is really bringing all the chi into your eyeballs, into your eyes, really working with the muscles in behind the eyeballs that move the eyes around. So this is great eye exercise. And then looking straight ahead again. Okay, the second one we're going to do, again, I want you to close your eyes. And I want you to, in your mind's eye now, imagine an object that's a few meters away from you. So imagine something like a tree or a flower, something that you're going to be looking at although your eyes are closed it's this imaginary object you're looking at a few meters away 
So just doing that for a little while. And then open your eyes and look at it one more time. So imagine that it's there in front of you, even if it's not really. And then just look at that object and keep your eyes focused on that one spot. And this is really focusing your vision, it's focusing your eyesight on one point. And then just relax. And you can again repeat that a few times. But again, a great exercise for your eyes for really just focusing on the one spot. And the third thing you can do is a really nice little um, stimulation for the eyes, bringing a bit of heat to the eyes. And the way in which we do that is take both your palms together, rub them together really vigorously so they get nice and hot. You can generate lots of heat between your palms doing this. And then you're going to close your eyes and place the palms of your hands flat over your closed eyes. And just feeling the heat melting in from the palms of the hands into the eyeballs, right into the backs of the eyes. Feel it going all the way in. Nourishing the eyes, energizing the eyes. And then release the palms of the hands open your eyes and just take some time to observe just look around you now and see whether your vision actually appears a little bit brighter a little bit more clear often it does and especially if you practice exercises like these out in nature where you've got natural daylight you can often notice a huge difference between before practicing and after practicing when you do these eye exercises and the fourth thing you can do is refer to a previous video of mine. And this is an exercise which is part of a series of eight in my paid membership program for Space to Relax. But I also posted this as a separate video in my blog. And it's called Combating Excess with the Bardo Engine. So the Bardo Engine is the eight pieces of brocade exercise which is the eight exercises in the paid program but this particular one is really helpful because it's looking at the fists with your eyes wide open and it's stimulating the liver pathway the liver channel um, because you're using the eyes in this way so i'll put the link to that video next to this one or underneath this one you'll be able to find that really easily so i would encourage you to practice that exercise as well in addition to the ones i've just shown you here so what can you do next if you want to take your Qigong practice to a whole other level? So I've given you a few little tips here and just given you a taster of what's involved in Qigong exercises for the eyes. But what you can do is you can also head over to my homepage, which is spacetorelax.com. And there you'll see that you can sign up for a free three-part video series of Qigong lessons. So they're completely free. They'll be delivered to your email over the course of around a week. And what you'll learn in there are free, are free lessons, three really good ones, which will help you to improve your overall general level of health and therefore, of course, benefit your eyes as well. But if you really want to take it and ramp it up a whole other notch, you'll see at the end of that video series, you'll see some information on how to join the paid program of Space to Relax, which is a membership site. There are 50 videos, training videos in that membership site, which are delivered one a week over the course of around a year. And I guide you step by step through each of those video lessons. So that really is a complete health management a course of Qigong lessons. So people in the membership site are using it for fibromyalgia, for arthritis, for digestive problems, for anxiety and depression, for all kinds of different health conditions, as well as obviously energizing their bodies, calming their minds and helping them to sleep much better at night time. So that's one thing you can do. The second thing you can do is don't forget to subscribe to YouTube. If you're watching this on YouTube, hit the red subscribe button and then you won't miss any future videos of mine. 
And the third thing you can do is head over to Facebook where I have a free group called Space to Relax Free Group. And in that group, you could just, uh, you just ask to join. I'll admit you straight away. And then what you can do is ask any questions you might have on Qigong or on general health matters. You can also read in that group regular posts that I will post about um, things I find maybe online that are not from me, but other interesting things about Qigong, about meditation and general health using Chinese medicine and Qigong. So I would encourage you to join the Facebook group. And really thank you so much for watching this video today. Um, I know eye problems will all, they affect us for all of us, I think, from time to time. So I hope you found those little exercises I showed you really useful. And if you like this video and you want to leave a comment, then please do. And until next time, I'll see you in the next video.